Okay, welcome everyone to Good Installation Practices. We've got Albert uh, and Bill and Luke uh, sitting in on this little presentation. Good Installation Practices for your PLC. Bear in mind that we've got a whole set of um, chapters available for each one of these presentations and you can get all the details at the end of the presentation, which will be about four minutes. Uh, we're going to briefly talk about introduction to PLC installation, uh, PLC wiring, field device wiring, a very important to topic of earthing or grounding, and um, some safety considerations. I just want to ask you, uh, Albert and Bill, um, are you guys, uh, have you installed a PLC before? Over to you guys. Yeah, actually, Steve, I have, and uh, I had some problem with shielding. Marvellous. Okay, well, we'll be getting on to that topic. Uh, thanks very much, Bill. And I know you're in New York and uh, Albert's in London, and I'm based in boring old Perth, Western Australia. Okay, so the point to make is that obviously a good installation is very important. Perhaps, uh, and I know I sound repetitive here, perhaps not as sexy as a, a PL, programming a PLC, but just as critical. So very important uh, to look at some of these rules that we're going to go through now. Here we have a typical shield. And I just want to ask uh, Albert or Bill, can you tell me what a, what do you think a shield does for you there? Over to you guys. Well, uh, like uh, Bill said, uh, I'm a little confused, uh, Steve. Uh, shielding, uh, there's a lot of misinformation out there. Thanks very much, Albert. Yep, absolutely. Lots of misinformation. One of the most critical things about a shield, which tries to minimize the problems of noise getting into your clean electrical circuit, which is connected to your PLC, uh, very important to actually earth at one point only, or ground at one point only, as you can see here. Can you see that? All connected at one point only. This side here, of course, no um, connection of the shield to ground at all. Otherwise, you'll end up with a what we call a ground uh, loop, which we're not going to talk about here. Uh, other issues are isolate your circuit from one end to the other. So here we've got transformer coupling. You can see complete electrical isolation or galvanic isolation between this side here with your nasty electrical surges and spikes and over here with your wonderful clean PLC input. So it's very important to put that in. Um, Albert or Bill, can you tell me what other uh, approach you can follow beyond transformer coupling. What, what's another uh, possible solution? Yeah, over to you guys. Uh, yeah, Steve, I guess we tend to use uh, optoelectric here. Spot on, Bill, spot on. Optical isolation, optical electric is uh, very good. Optical isolation is to isolate, yeah, no, it's a lot uh, more common than the transformer coupling. Okay, last uh, point to talk about is PLC earthing. It's a subject on its own, but I'll spend a few minutes on that. Um, method, different methods of earthing, and probably the most common way here, and should we say the uh, most important way is to earth to one point over here. So you've got one earthing point. Uh, this approach here is fraught with hazard, and this approach here you'd find in a power station, but it can be very expensive with a grid. Um, a few other little issues you need to be aware of is um, when you're switching solid state relays, um, you may find a snubber network very important over here, RC network, and um, that concludes the presentation. I just want to ask um, Albert or Bill or Luke, Albert, can you tell me any, any questions that you guys may have? Over to you. Uh, no, thank you, Steve. It's uh a uh, short and sweet presentation there, but I think uh, you covered the basics. Great. Thanks very much, Albert and uh, Bill. Uh, just one final word. Uh, this this 20-page uh, des description in a lot more detail is available from books at idc-online.com. So if you want to get a copy of this extract from our manual, just go straight there, email uh, as per uh, right up here and uh, ask for good installation practices for PLCs and we'll send you the 30 page uh, write up and Maria will send you. Thanks very much for listening in guys and uh, cheers. Bye.